Hey, I'm Dr. Marvin. This is Recovery and Reinvention. And I'm just here to talk with you, straight talk. But before I get to it, I do want to say, once again, I am Dr. Marvin. I am not giving medical advice. I'm a doctor, philosophy of religion, and I'm also a counselor uh, certified by uh, CCAP, which is a California Consortium of Alcohol and Drug Professionals. I am not talking to you in that capacity either. This is only for entertainment or educational purposes only. And basically, once again, this is recovery and reinvention. Everyone needs that. People go through life, and when we're young, we don't think things are going to happen. But things do happen. Sometimes we get into a rut, and we just don't like where we are. So we need to do something different to get a different result. Because no one wants to be in insanity, doing the same thing over and over again, getting a different result. Sometimes people may get hurt or injured, uh, maybe on the job, maybe in a car accident. They get pain pills, and then next thing they know, all of a sudden they're addicted to them. All of a sudden they have an addiction on them, their hands. Or maybe they grew up with an addiction in their family. Maybe pills or drink alcohol. A lot of these entertainers today, first they're drinking this stuff called lean, this uh, cough syrup, they're uh, taking these prescription drugs. Some people uh, are just overweight and all of a sudden they looked in the mirror and look at where they are. There's a lot of different ways people need recovery. Once a person recovers, they're not always the same person. They can't always go back to the same lifestyle because the same lifestyle is going to lead them back where they were dissatisfied. And that's the key word, dissatisfied. You want to describe dissatisfied? Restless, irritable, and discontent. So with that being said, recovery is recovery. You, whether you're getting off of drugs, whether you're losing weight, whether you're an over shopper, whether, whether you're an overeater, if you gamble too much, no matter what it is, it's, we're not satisfied with ourselves. The first order of business is to get, to get a psychic change, to start thinking different. Because when we think different, we behave different. And you know, be right before that, we have to have the realization that, you know what? I am restless. I am irritable. I am discontent. And you can't be in denial. D-E-N-A-I-L. Denial. Don't even know I am lying. I cannot lie to myself and tell me that I'm happy and everything is great and, and it's just all butterflies and unicorns. Because it's not like that all the time. And when people are honest with themselves about their own feelings and where they are in life, they could do something about it. The reinvention comes after you recover. You gain some type of footing and then you're able to choose who you want to be one day at a time. And so I'm not uh, philosophizing on any 12-step program or any uh, support group or any one diet or anything like that. That's up to you to decide what you need to do in your particular situation. I'm just talking about the realization that, hey, maybe I got one too many DUIs, whatever it may be. I don't know what, what, what you need to get recovery and reinvention from, but whatever it is, we're going to be talking episodes to come. And so uh, I'm on this road right now. Uh, there's a couple of things of uh, recovery that I'm recovering from, and uh, I'll share that with you. You know, I mean, just obviously look at me right now. I'm overweight. And I'll tell you what. As the time goes on, I'm doing something about it. And you get to take the ride with me. And we get to ride together. And we get to recover we get together. And we can reinvent ourselves. I can re reinvent myself. You can reinvent yourself. And we can meet at the top. Because it doesn't have to stop. I think that rhymed. Anyway, I'm Dr. Marvin. This is Recovery and Reinvention. And I'll see you next time. <music>